Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum and hi. Welcome back to OBS Studio course video series. Yeah, in these videos, we will learn how to create a digital or virtual classroom with a virtual uh, whiteboard like this one. Okay, where we have your yourself in front of, of the class and you have a whiteboard behind it and you are will be able to draw today we're going to create a virtual classroom classroom with virtual whiteboard okay let's begin okay let's uh, start with a blank classroom like this you already know how to create a set like this you have a background and you have a webcam in the previous video now all we have to do is we have we want to create a whiteboard at the back here so how we do that okay before that uh, i would highly suggest for you guys to start using a drawing tablet device this is h420 you can get it on shopee or lazada or or other brands but I, I suggest you guys use this one because it's uh, kind of low cost and you can you can use it wherever you want it's small size okay you can start with uh, uh, open paint program in your uh, windows you can just click on paint here and you open a new paint this is just a normal paint right you can you can you can draw you can like uh, write whatever it is right if you, if you if you're using a drawing tablet you can write this pretty easy la. when you have done that on your obs studio you go to the source and then you look for window capture okay you have a lot of this you go to window capture okay let's say we then click ok right so if if you if you cannot see this in the uh, right after you click OK, you can click on the window here. This is part the window part here. You can select paint. So you have select MS Paint. Eh? Okay. So select. You should go something like this, and then you click OK. Right. So your paint should appear in your OBS scene. Okay. Right. Like I, I have told you before, if you want like your webcam is in front of the pane, all you have to do is just click your source webcam source and then you just drag upward. Uh, so you, now your face is up front. Okay. Right. So next step is if you can see here, whatever things that shows in the MS pane is being shown in the OBS studio. We don't want that. We don't want all this. Just un unless you want that, it's okay. But for me, I want just want to show the the white area only, so it can look something like this, right? It's only like a virtual whiteboard. Only the white part is shown in the scene. Similar to what we have learned before, we can just click on the source, click uh, right click on it, and then click filters. Okay, filters. And then you can, you can just click plus here and then similar to before you can just click on the crop slash pad click ok and then you can just add values to the left top right bottom here until only the white part of the ms pin is shown okay so i put something like so bottom is like 50 i think right so it's only uh or the white part of the paint, the canvas in the paint is shown in the uh, OBS Studio. So can get close. So this is the your virtual whiteboard. How about we we test it? By the way, you can always uh you can always adjust the the size of your of your webcam here, right? Uh, so for example, you want to show more of your uh more drawing space in your in your video you can just adjust your your face here make it smaller right sometimes you want like to show here this and that this and that right so you can do that so let's test it, test it out okay right so uh you just open your pane 
just now you please don't close this right you have to make sure it's it's it is always open throughout your recording or your streaming okay so i i turn on my my uh, tablet drawing tablet and i'm going to draw it don't draw it on the obs okay <laughs> draw it on the ms pin mm, i'll pick this one so test one two three okay uh, if you if you think the line is quite uh, not not to your liking it's too small you can always change the size you see here when we change the size it's not shown in the obs studio the, that is very neat and looking nice lah on your video okay you can change the size so this is test one two three and then you can use whichever color that you want uh, whichever drawing that you want right so I think this is one of the method lah on how you want to use traditional chalk and talk method of teaching. I think the experienced lecturer and teachers love to use it. I think the only, of course, the younger generation of uh, educators may also like to use this. And you can use it. So this is just a simple way on how to manipulate uh, OBS Studio. There are much other ways of using it. Okay, I think that's it for this uh, video. I hope you can uh, try it on your own and enjoy using OBS Studio. Until the next video, Assalamualaikum.